Hi, I'm Mike Skeen, driver of the number two Hawk Performance CRP Racing Chevy Corvette. Skeen is through with the Hawk Performance Corvette. I started in racing uh, when I was 10 years old, driving go-karts uh, with my dad. Uh, we both just went out to a local track and drove around and started you know, doing some local racing. And Mike Skeen and the Hawk Performance Vet having a great day today as well. Wow, my favorite race so far has probably been you know, my first World Challenge race back in 2010 uh, with these guys at CRP Racing. We ran the Craig Corvette then, um, ran them into Ohio, we won our first race and that was you know, a huge step for my career. Favorite car? Uh, you know. It's tough to, I would say as a race car, you know, I really enjoy driving this uh, Hawk Performance Corvette. It's, you know, very well balanced, a lot of fun, sounds awesome. Uh, street car wise, you know, I'm, I'm kind of a BMW guy. I grew up that way. My dad was super into BMWs. I've got an old BMW that I'm doing a, a V8 Chevy swap into right now. Uh, so that's going to kind of be my new toy, I think, and probably my favorite for now. Three cars going after it. Johnny O'Connell, Mike Skeen, Andy Pilgrim. Then a the little bit of a gap as we hop on board with Mike Skeen in that Hawk Performance Corvette. Oh, oh what a move! Mike Skeen, I think O'Connell got obviously balked by that lap car and Mike went around the outside. I don't know that there was room for that. Somehow he made it work. Standing starts are intense. Uh, you know, there's lots of energy on the grid. Um, all of a sudden lights go out and, you know, it's game on. never know what to expect. You can plan, you know, I'm going to go left, I'm going to go right. I know these guys will get a good launch, but, it, you know, it all goes out the window as soon as the lights go off. And uh, really intense, fun, you know, fun for the fans to watch and always exciting for us. And Mike Skeen in the Nissan GTR this weekend lines up six in the GT class. The Nissan GTR is an awesome platform. I've gotten a, a you know, great opportunity to coach a lot of guys with those. And, you know, just straight out of the box with a stock street car you can drive to the grocery store. It is amazing, you know, best bang for the buck probably. And, uh, it's super fun to drive, you know, very complex, you know, lots of uh, electronics behind it and stuff. The race car we use is a little bit different. It's rear drive, you know, it gets rid of some of the electronics uh, just, you know, based on rules and that sort of thing. Um, so it's a little bit different animal than the street cars, but, you know, it's a, it's a good platform to start with and we're really enjoying playing with it. Back to this battle up front and Skeen getting through traffic very, very cleanly. O'Connell following him through and it uh, looks like Pilgrim got that group as well, so still staying close. Well, that whole Corvette has always shown speed, Greg. They just sometimes don't have the reliability. They've also been trying to develop the Nissan at the same time. So uh, the CRP team have had a lot to deal with over the last couple of years. Back on board with leader Mike Skeen at Hawk Performance Corvette and uh, just catching traffic at the right time. Moving over on the brakes, down into the climbing turn. Listen for the engine note change. <laughs> right there. I think he almost gives a little lift there, sounded like at least. Welcome to Setup. I race clean, I don't bend cars, but I'm fast. Setup was an interesting show. You know, we, it, the filming was over a month. We raced one day, we're all, you know, working in the garage the next day and just did that for the whole month. And so it was very busy, really intense schedule. Um, you know, learned a lot about racing and prepping the cars. Uh, not that we hadn't done that before, but having all that, you know, jam-packed in the tight schedule was busy. Um, we ended up winning the most races in, on the show, uh, but we got wrecked in the last race, so we didn't really get anything directly from the show, uh, except for a lot of exposure. So, you know, that certainly helped move my career along, but uh, it was more just the experience and the exposure more than anything else. Skeen, down to the inside. Can he get it done in the diving turn? He's through. Oh, but he hits the curb. O'Connell checks up to not get into the back of him. And here comes Andy Pilgrim around the outside. Skeen is going to do it, but Pilgrim! Looks like he got it for second kill, unbelievable. Great job by Mike Skeen. Just held on to that perfectly. Fans are huge, you know. If uh, we didn't have fans, we couldn't do this. You know, it's all about marketing, getting out there, enjoying the fans, getting the name of, you know, Hawk Performance and Pirelli World Challenge, all the, you know, the supporters of the series out there. And, if, you know, if the fans weren't around, we'd just be driving in circles.